Hi Alphas, welcome. Today I am going through my Influencer Most Reviewed Top Rated Best in Beauty box. I'm so excited. There are a lot of awesome things in this beauty box and actually things that I've been wanting to try. I'm excited to dig in and kind of show you what is in this box. This is the Love and Beauty Planet Coconut Water and Mimosa Flower Luscious Hydration Body Lotion. I love the shampoo and the conditioner and the body scrub. I'm excited to try the lotion out. Next up, CoverGirl. CoverGirl has their True Naked Chocoholic Palette. This one I've been looking at and I'm excited to try this and it was included in their box and it's their new branding. I'm excited to try this out. This is what the Chocoholic Palette looks like. Next up from ColourPop, this is in Lightning Bug. I love a lot of the sh Super Shock shadows from ColourPop. It's just a super beautiful color. Oh. It's like that nice bronzy. Oh, and it's wet looking. Oh, excited to try this one. Next in the box, I have the Unique Moonstruck Epic Mascara. Now these are products that are highly rated on Influencer. If you are not an Influencer, I will have a link down below so you can join. You have a better chance of joining if you use my link because I'm already on it. So definitely check it out. It smells kind of funny though. It smells like paint. I'm not sure how this is gonna go for my watery lids, but we're gonna try it. I personally have not used Pons in a very long time, just because the scent reminds me of my papa and sometimes it makes me sad because I know that he's in heaven. This is a facial moisturizer and I love face moisturizers, I love creams. So I'm excited to try this out. Origins Ginseng. I've had, I had this. I actually had like several samples of this and I really do love it. This is an eye cream. I have the face one. So this is supposed to brighten and deep puff and you apply it in the morning. So I'm gonna start trying this tomorrow. There's like a little illumination to it too. That's pretty. It's our 10th anniversary. Orbe, oh, I like this stuff. I actually had another sample of this like a few years ago when I made it last. And I'm very picky in particular with my hair products. So if I like something for my hair and I mention it more than once and I don't change from it, that means I really like it and it really works for me. So I'm excited to have that again. Amika Perk Up Dry Shampoo. I was always like curious about this brand. I love their packaging. It's super colorful and super cute. This is a dry shampoo. Oh, it smells good. Oh, it smells really good. Excited to try that. I have the Kula Sport SPF. Oh, I love SPF. This is a classic sunscreen. It's organic skincare and it's SPF 50. Ooh, look at the packaging. See what it feels like. Oh, this is very light and it blends out clear. I like a clear sunscreen because it doesn't add like a white mask onto my skin because it's very apparent and it changes the color of my foundation. So this is gonna be nice. Becca, Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed in Vanilla Quartz. I actually gifted this a bigger one to my sister because I thought that she would love it. She loves highlighters like I do. We love to glow. That's so cute. It's like a cute little one. It has like a cute little mirror. It's very gold. And that's why I thought it would better suit her, but I can definitely use it as like a topper. I have this Bautiste, I think that's how you pronounce it. Dry shampoo, and vibrant and fruity neon. I do need a little, ooh, it smells good. I do need a little dry shampoo. Oh, it feels nice. And it's definitely more, no, I have to match it. I have Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Texturizing Sea Salt Spray. I don't really use a lot of sea salt sprays, but I'm willing to try. I have the Jurgens Natural Glow. I have this, I love this. This is one of my favorite products to use during the spring. This is one of my favorite drugstore setting sprays. It's the matte finish. This was like my holy grail when I had oily skin because nothing really worked. The only thing I don't like about it is it's small. This is the actual size of it. Hopefully I don't have to use as much of it as I used to. Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub. Oh, I like these. I actually had one like, not this one, but it was like an orangey brown. What does this one smell like? Ooh. 
It actually smells like my hair shampoo. Oh God, I'm gonna use this in the shower tonight. We're gonna see what this does. And then I have an Origins ginseng. Oh, it's like, it's like the same one. It's just like a little sample. Now I have another side that I have to go through. This is the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Lolita. I think, I don't think, I know this is one of their top selling lipsticks. It's a very pretty color. It's like very mauve -y. Next up, hairspray. This is like the hairspray that I used to use back in high school. So I have extra hairspray. I have so much hairspray, but this is like an OG. I actually forgot about this hairspray, so that's cool. I have an EOS Evolution of Smooth Shave Cream. I actually use their shave cream and I love it. This is one of my favorite ones. I love the scent of it. And I always go back to it. I, I go back to the Skin to Mint one and then I go back to this one. So I like this. What else? I have like little baggies. I have a Purity Philosophy. Is this a face wash? Yes, it's a cleanser. So I'm gonna try this tonight. Oh. I've always seen them at Sephora, but I never, never really went and, you know, purchased it. So that's nice. I'm gonna try that also. This is the Lactic Acid Treatment and it deeply exfoliates dull, exfoliates the dull surface of skin for clarity, radiance, and younger looking skin. You know I love my acids, so I'm excited to try this one too. It's like a tiny little sample, but we'll try it. The Hawaiian Detox Warming Mud Mask. It has anti-pollution volcanic clay. I wonder if it'll work double because I'm also Hawaiian. Garnier Fructis Color Vibrancy Treat One Minute Hair Mask. I actually tried this and I love it. So I'm excited to have another one. So I'm gonna try this when I wash my hair. And then I have an apple cider vinegar scalp, scalp scrub with pink Himalayan sea salt, DPQ ACV. That's cool. I've actually tried salt, salt scrubs before. It didn't really work out in my hair. My hair is pretty thick in its natural state, but I did feel that it did add, you know, some nice, it, it felt like my, my hair was super clean. So I'm excited to try that too. There was also a Real Techniques facial sponge in there. It's like new and improved. It's actually dirty because I used it today, but I really do like it because I love Real Techniques. So I'll make sure I'll show you a little screen grab of it, but that is it. That's what's in my top rated best in beauty from Influencer. There's the box. It's so cute. I'm gonna keep the box because it's cute. Let me know if you've tried any of the products down in the comment box. Give this video a thumbs up and make sure that you subscribe and turn on that bell so you don't miss any other videos from me. Thanks so much for taking time to watch and I'll see you next time.